guys, welcome to Riyadh 2015 with Quick Mustang and today I'm going to be showing you an hour of footage from Riyadh 2015 on Saturday the 18th of July. Hope you enjoy, I'll speak to you again in an hour. So, see you guys. Thank you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, as they approach back to the hover, you have Captain Jim Slayer and Sergeant Luck in gunship one to your right, and warrant officers Folks and Nash in gunship two to your left. Please put your hands together for the 2015 Attack Helicopter Display Team.
first flew in 1952, only 11 years after the first flight of the Lancaster. Look at the two of them together, and you think they come from different centuries. Not a bit of it. Designed by the same team. and Serco, but it is the three technical authority companies that will finally bring Vulcan's illustrious flying life to a close.
twisting this loop towards us through 90 degrees in what's known as a quarter clover. Now get your cameras ready. This is the vertical break.
I wish I was up there doing it with the boys today because it is a truly fabulous experience. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you've got some fantastic pictures. Please do post them on our Facebook page, RAF Renault. Tweet them to at RAF Red 10 at RAF Renault. We will very much look forward to seeing you. As they come past you, the race will be in tomorrow. We look forward to the screen for you again then. But for now, please enjoy the rest of your afternoon. I wish you all the very best from everybody at the Royal Air Force Aerobatic Team. That's all the reds and blues that belong to the Renault. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, and thank you to Squadron Leader Mike Green, who's had a splendid job as ever. As the Red Arrows roll out, we're going to move on to the next generation, well, the current generation, one might say, because it's in service of Royal Air Force Airlift. But, uh, Mark, the RAF also put a strong social media presence here. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and uh, just a message really to anybody with a camera, uh, which is probably 90% of the audience. Um, would you please tweet your best Royal Air Force pictures uh, to our Twitter page with performance? Yeah, this Twitter aircraft is going to be the mainstay of tactical to strategic airlift for the Royal Air Force for the next 25 years. Uh, we now have three aircraft. The first one is to take them into service in November last year, uh, having got its initial release to service into RAF usage uh, about a month previous to that. Um, incremental capability increases uh, are going on all the time.
Part of the whole PC as they depart in a first call departure. On the behalf of the Fetchy Service Recipients from the Royal Manor Passage, I would like to do a warm welcome of this beautiful day at the uh, Royal International Air Fitting. In a few moments on the right side, we will see the Fetchy approaching to left. setting up May 17 is now in phase maintenance so that's why you see a normal operational effect to form the show. With this demonstration we would like to show you the agility and the performance of the effect by maneuver called the split F. The effect is shown this way in the world and the airport here for the final. Quarter slope lead. Halfway along will now be performing the wobble. Requiring 
excellent hand, eye and foot coordination. Vulcan with the two Lancasters, got an introduction to the F-35 lightning in it as well, and some uh, extended in-cockpit displays from aboard of the 52 of the and the National Stadium as well. So lots uh, on offer there, but I think capturing this year's uh, air show, which uh, today has just been absolutely outstanding, real substance today, and a memorable day, completely perfect weather as well. So DVD to... Future generations of, of Typhoon pilots. Mirages, um, it is very really noisy, so please do protect the ears of the young. So, so loud, but um, uh, of course, I'm sure many of you will want to stay and see these really closing two really items. And here is Sergeant Carla Bale, um, who, mask man wearing, goodbye, have a safe journey home, and I'll hand you over to George Bacon. Well,